So we're going to create an opportunity from Outlook. So in this situation, this first email is, is a contact that I know exists. Uh, it's a company we sell to, but he's, he would like a quote based on my upgrade campaign um, for some new laptops. So if I, again, click on my Acumatica add-in at the top, it's going to load that. Um, like I said before, it's recognizing that he exists. It even pulls in the contact name at the top. So now I have different options down here. I have create a case, create an opportunity. Um, again, these view options will actually load a pop-up window from Acumatica. But for this one, I'm going to create an opportunity. So it's going to, again, pull in my subject. It's going to default the stage, which we'll look at that in a minute. Um, you can enter a price, an amount if you know approximately how much this opportunity is going to be worth. Um, or you can leave it blank and just take what it gives you and create opportunity. Okay, so that will now be in our Acumatica web page. So if I look down here on my dashboard, I also have my opportunities. And I can drill into that list. Okay, I think it's not linked to me yet, so we'll do that. Um, so here's my new quote for new laptop from Mike. We will open that up here. And I can assign myself as the owner. Okay, so within the opportunity, you can add items that are going to be quoted. And then you can actually create the quote from the opportunity. So they're all linked and it's all manageable uh, within the same module. So I'm going to, so I've assigned it to myself. I'm going to switch it to open as I'm now interacting with my customer and updating information within this opportunity. And if I flip over to document details, I can add an item here, and he wanted three laptops, and I can decide to give him a 20% discount, and I can enter all of that in here. Also on the details, so we said that he had contacted us for this quote based on our marketing campaign of upgrade. So I'm going to add that source campaign, and that's what's going to link it to include it in the metrics on the marketing campaign. All right, and I'm also up here going to take a look at stages. So we're going to change this to proof since we're already to the point of sending them a quote. So as your sales reps work to make the sale, they can use these stages to reflect the likelihood they will win the opportunity. So the settings of the stages is also linked to a percentage of closing that opportunity. And the stages are fully configurable and can be used with this opportunity total to report on forecasting for sales. So if we take a quick look at this opportunity summary report, you can see that this is broken out by opportunity class. So you could have different groups of opportunities. And then it's also broken out across the top um, by stage. So with this pivot table, we can see, okay, how many of my product sales opportunities are in the negotiation stage and what's the value of those? So you can manage that forecasting. 